Hi, my name is Eileen Nazario, and I'm an engineer on the Soundcheck team at Spotify. As a totally impartial observer, I think Soundcheck is probably one of the most impactful backstage plugins we've created at Spotify. Soundcheck was created with a vision to promote engineering excellence through clear scorecards, actionable feedback, and positive reinforcement thereby improving developer experience and leading to faster releases. It fundamentally changed the health of our technology ecosystem. Quite literally, Soundcheck is how we drew a straight line between an individual developer's decision-making for their components to our top-line goals for engineering excellence and quality. Just by showing our developers opportunities to improve our tech health, we've driven significant decreases in technology fragmentation. And this consistency makes everyone at Spotify more productive. Our belief is that the external Soundcheck plugin can bring that value to you too, by enabling you to codify your own organization's development best practices and operational standards. First, by providing a framework for measuring and aggregating the health of components across an organization. And second, by visualizing checks for security, testing, reliability, and other needed tech health programs. With the Soundcheck plugin, developers can see how well their components measure up to engineering best practices and standards at a glance. And as we've proven out at Spotify, seeing leads to doing. When owners can easily see the tech health of their components, it incentivizes quality, reliability, and alignment throughout your software ecosystem. A little background on how Soundcheck came to be. For years, Spotify has used the concept of the golden path to make developers onboarding easier and encourage standardization. Each engineering discipline has a golden path, which is the recommended set of technologies and patterns you can use to build out new components. The golden path provides the best supported, easiest way to build something new. Our golden paths help us defragment our tech ecosystem, reduce total complexity, and also allows us to automate migration of our software fleet more easily. However, they only affect the starting point of each component. In a healthy ecosystem of software components, many components will routinely be maintained for years. So how do we encourage standardization of a component as it evolves, and even as the standards themselves evolve? That's where the golden state comes in. The golden state is a quantifiable and actionable list of criteria that measures alignment to the golden path. It is a short list of how to take any component back onto the golden path. And most importantly, it's an implicit promise to software developers that if they align with the golden state, they not only get a bunch of stuff for free like security, scalability, observability, but that as we upgrade, they won't have to worry about that. Our platform teams will manage them moving forward. The Soundcheck plugin was born out of a need for our developers to self-assess how they were doing against these concepts. You likely have your own version of Golden State at your company, but that's just one thing you can measure. With Soundcheck, you can map any program, which we define as a set of operational standards or a long-term tech health initiative you might have. At Spotify, we have programs related to security, testing, reliability, and are working on many more to come. Let's take Test Certified as an example. Our initial goal was to get test flakiness below 10%. Since then, flakiness has dropped to below 1%, which shows the power of just putting relevant data in front of smart engineers. We help them measure it, and what we find is that's enough. They do the rest. Our success here can really be traced back to that Spotify secret sauce we've been talking about. At its heart, Soundcheck is a tool that incentivizes behavior change in an effort to make everyone just a little bit happier. At Spotify, no one is forced to align to the golden state or to get their components test certified. There is no one telling you as a developer that you have to do it. However standardization and best practices happen at your company, Soundcheck allows your infrastructure teams to be teachers and advocates for feature teams instead of mandate enforcers. On the flip side, if you do have regulatory requirements or compliance needs that aren't so optional, Soundcheck includes an API that you can use to verify that components are meeting the standards you need to meet. Let's dive into how the plugin works. The Soundcheck tab on the component page shows the Soundcheck programs that are applicable for the active component in the tabs across the top. Each Soundcheck program is a collection of levels, and each level consists of one or more checks. 
Each check can have rich content associated with it, which provides an opportunity to sell the value of the check and convince engineering teams to spend time getting it to pass, and also to provide any relevant documentation to make it easy for them to do so. When a check is failing, you can also provide details of the reason for that failure so that the underlying cause can be addressed efficiently. As an example, let's say we just merged changes to this component to increase its code coverage to above the threshold for this check. As you submit updated check results to SoundCheck, we will see the state of this check change from failed to passed. Now that the coverage has increased above the threshold, the check is now showing a green check mark and the progress bar for its level has moved one step closer to being complete. However, we still have more to do in order to complete the entire level. As you can see, we still have a failing check. The component is missing metadata defining its lifecycle in the Backstage catalog. If we again merge a change which adds this metadata and updated check results are pushed to sound check, the has component lifecycle defined check will pass too. This component is now sequentially passing all checks at levels one, two, and three in this program. So we get a full green bar, confetti everywhere, and now we have a fully certified Q proxy. The badge has been updated to show level three certification. The soundcheck view on this component page helps focus closely on evaluating and improving a single component. But what about when a broader view is needed? That's where the soundcheck overview page comes in. This page provides a bird's eye view of how well a collection of components is aligned to your organization's operational and development standards. This page also provides a glanceable view of compliance for each program and helps to highlight checks that might need attention across multiple components in your org. Now that we've covered the user experience, let's talk a little bit about soundcheck programs themselves. Soundcheck programs are tightly coupled to your own organization's operational and development standards. We provide some example programs along with Soundcheck, but the real power comes from creating your own programs to codify these standards. Programs are defined in YAML as part of the backstage configuration. You can define as many programs as you'd like, and Soundcheck includes the ability to filter both programs and the checks within them so you can make sure that developers only see programs and checks that make sense for each of their components. In the future, we'll be exploring ways to make defining and evolving programs even easier, so watch this space. We're excited about what we've built already, but where are we going from here? First, we want to centralize as much of the work of collecting check results as possible to minimize the work required to adopt SoundCheck. Today, SoundCheck doesn't help with the work of actually performing each check, and submitting into Backstage. But that will change in, in short order. We'll be shipping a check running framework that handles the work of running checks within Backstage and provides systems to collect the information we need to generate check results for some common checks. This system will also be extensible so that you can add checks for any metric you're interested in with minimal effort and we'll continue evolving and expanding this functionality by adding support for collecting more kinds of check results from third-party tools over time. Along with making it easier to collect check results, we're also looking at ways to help you leverage the power of this rich data you're collecting in SoundCheck. This data is already available via the SoundCheck GraphQL API, but we'd like to make it easy to visualize in Backstage by providing things like graphs that show the history of a check result more powerful tools for visualizing program compliance for many components at once, and aggregated views of how program compliance is changing over time. And that's SoundCheck. So instead of asking your developers to file and respond to yet another ticket, you can instead promote software quality through clear scorecards, actionable feedback, and positive reinforcement.